What's up guys, got some more Modern Warfare action for you today. So, this is going to be my second impression of this game. My first impressions were really not that great. And I think Ground War may have saved it for me. We'll see, I'm going to wait for some changes and, and see what happens in the full game. I'm waiting for a few things. Uh, mainly, if, point, if the Point Man perk is not just a rumor, if that's a real thing, and our kill streaks become score streaks if we have that point uh, if we have that perk equipped i'll probably buy the game off of that alone because that's probably my biggest gripe with the ground war situation is that the kill streaks are kill streaks and not score streaks so you get you have no incentive to play the objective so everybody's playing it like tdm and i'm somebody that liked to play the objective while getting kills like i thought it was fun to like jump on the flag and get a bunch of kills and get your score streak really quick and play the objective aggressively and do well, you know, and then have that awesome moment where you know you've got you're doing the best of both worlds and you get your kill streaks. So I, I really like that, um, and you you can't do that in this game. You have to play this like tactical campy play style, and uh, you know I want to jump on the flag, but I'm not going to risk my fucking kill streak that I'm like three kills off of or two kills off of to jump on the flag. But if it's a score streak, then it's worth my while to do that, right? It, it gets everybody playing the objective in their score streak. So there's a lot of people complaining about that. Hopefully that changes. If that changes, I'll probably buy the game. Um, but the thing is, is that every, ugh, the core game modes, I, I just don't like them, man. It's tedious. Um, I get what they wanted to do. I get that they wanted to make the game tactical. And it's like, this game is like a mix of um, Rainbow Six, Battlefield, and COD. That's probably the best way to describe this game. It's a, it's a little bit of everything from, the, from those categories. But when you translate that to the core game modes, to the 6v6 and the small scale stuff, it's just tedious. Like, I get what they wanted to do, but it's just not fun to constantly aim check every corner and ADS around every... Like, it's just tedious. And uh, they went away from the three-lane map design, so you have no idea where people could be. They could be anywhere. Uh, so it just really slows the game down a lot. But in Ground War, where there's more people and there's vehicles and you have squads, and uh, when you extrapolate that to a larger conflict it actually works and you it, it, it makes sense and it's fun so uh anyone that didn't get to play ground war i kind of feel bad for you because i feel like this game is ground war um there you can have a lot of fun with ground war and if you're somebody i think this game will appeal to a lot of people because there's a lot of people and i think i sort of fall in this this camp where you like battlefield and you play battlefield but you're not that into the vehicles if that's you this game is great. This game will be perfect for you because the gunplay in this game is the best of any FPS, in my opinion. They have nailed it. The animations, the sounds, the gunplay is so satisfying in this game. Call of Duty's always nailed that, and they have fucking really nailed it in this one. So if you're if you're just if you're somebody that plays Battlefield for the crazy epic big battles and explosions and whatever, and you're not that into the vehicles, you don't care if the vehicles are a little bit dumbed down and not quite as um, center stage like they are in Battlefield. You're going to really like this game. So, um, this game is kind of exactly what I wanted in that regard. I, if Battlefield had kill streaks, I'd be totally down. Uh, so, I'm, I'm sort of leaning on buying this game. We'll, we'll see. I did refund my, uh, refund my pre-order um, just because I want to see if Point Man and the other stuff comes in. You know, it's one of those things where I have nothing to lose by refunding my pre-order, right? Um, I can always rebuy the game, right? But I can't always not rebuy the game. <laughs> that, as dumb as that sounds uh, but I had a lot of fun in the beta messing around with the marksman rifles they are I mean the M4 was so fucking OP that's that's definitely going to get nerfed before launch but I had a lot of fun with the marksman rifles very satisfying you have to you, again you have to play you really have to play campy with those because of the um, the flinch like if you get shot first with the marksman rifle you might as well just drop the controller because you're dead um, but it's very satisfying to get a headshot from really far away one hit kill with them um and running overkill with the uh, overkill is super OP too, but running overkill and having an SMG in your back pocket for situations like that is also very helpful. And here, uh, dude, this white phosphorus shit, what the fuck? So I'm going to call in my, uh, I'm going to get this campy kill. Ooh, dark, dark corner, dark corner, baby. So look at this thing, dude. The white phosphorus in this game is just insane. I, I, does anyone know what the effect is? So I get that when you drop it down, right, anyone that's close to it gets killed. But is there some sort of debuff it gives players? Like, do they not? Do they have low health all the time while it's up? Like, because look at how many assists I get. There's got to be some sort of effect. So if anybody knows what the white phosphorus actually does outside of killing people to get too close, it's got to do something. Because look at all the assists I get. 
Does it stop health regen? Does it, uh, do, do they have like less health while they're coughing or whatever? Does anyone know? I tried to talk to a dev about it, but I didn't get an answer. So, uh, anyway, Call of Duty Modern Warfare, meh, we'll see. Uh, Ground War might have saved it. We'll, we'll have to see. Uh, let me know what you guys thought of Ground War, and I will see you next time. Have a good one.